Angiosperms. Angiosperms constitute highly advanced plants which dominate the present vegetation. As the name indicates, in angiosperms, the ovules and seeds are enclosed in a sac-like structure called ovary, fruit, angio, sac, sperma means seed. The angiosperms exhibit the following features. 1. Angiosperms are a large group of plants occurring in wide range of habitat and their size varies from tiny olfia to tall trees, eucalyptus. 2. The sporophyte is the dominant phase of life history. It is differentiated into root, stem and leaf. 3. The leaves show distinct venation. 4. Vascular tissues are well developed. 5. Distinct secondary growth is seen. 6. Sexual reproduction is carried out by flowers which may be unisexual or bisexual. 7. Andrisium and gynesium are essential sex organs. They are surrounded by non-essential organs like calyx and corolla. 8. Pollen grains are produced by anthers of the stamen pollen grain is the male gametophyte. Female sex organ is pistil. Pistil consists of ovary with ovules. 9. Within the ovule, the female gametophyte or embryo sac is produced. Haploid. Embryo sac has three cell egg apparatus. One egg cell and two synergids, three antipodal cells and two polar nuclei. The polar nuclei fuse to produce diploid secondary nucleus. Pollen grain after dispersal from anthers are carried by air, water, insects, etc. to the stigma. This is termed as pollination. The pollen grains germinate on the stigma and the resulting pollen tubes grow through style and reach ovule. The pollen tube enters embryo sac where two male cell to form zygote. The other male gamete fuses with diploid secondary nucleus to produce triploid primary endosperm nucleus. Because of the involvement of two fusions, this event is termed as double fertilization. The zygote develops into embryo and primary endosperm nucleus develops embryo. The synergids and antipodals degenerate after fertilization. The ovules develop into seeds and the ovaries develop into fruit. 10. Pollination is indirect as ovules are enclosed in ovary. 11. The male gametes are non-motile. 12. Water is not essential for fertilization. 13. Angiosperms are characterized by double fertilization and triple fusion. 14. Endosperm is a post-fertilized product and is triploid. 15. As a result of post-fertilization changes, fruit formation takes place. Fruit encloses seeds. Angiosperm includes two classes, dicotyledons and monocotyledons. Dicotyledons, bean, sunflower, one. Two, cotyledons are seen in the seed. Two, root system is taproot. Three, leaves show reticulate venation. Four, flowers are tetramerous or pentamerous. Class dicotyledony is divided into three groups. 
polypathy b gamopathy c monoclamidy monocotyledons example rice wheat sugarcane one single cotyledon is seen in the seed two root system is of adventitious type three leaves are with parallel venation four flowers are trimmerous